all Star Wars fans and collectors, welcome back to another Rogue One video. In this video review, I'm taking a tell you of the Star Wars Force in 2 foot on Castle Guard and then I'll carry it in the pack. Oh, so yeah guys, I, I recently picked this guy up, this set up from, from up a toy world for um, $30, but yeah, I, I, I picked up $30 because because it, it, was, it was because it, it was the first time I've seen it in real life guys, because none of my stores have the... I'm I'm having I'm having like two packs and stuff, so I'm really happy to find this. So yeah, as always, I put the figures to the side and then I take a look at the packaging. So yeah, it's a standard two pack packaging from the so from the Solo Force Link line. At the top, we've got a Star Wars I'm I'm logo in yellow. I got a really nice image of the Castle Guard and the Carrizian. And we've got the white bottom. We've got we've got the white bubble. No. No, and we've got we've got we've got the yellow bubble and the force link logo, and the Disney Hatter logo on the side. We've got some more artwork from the um cover. On the back, it's just standard to Star Wars and advertise the horse link and stuff. So it's pretty pretty same and simple. But yeah, but this, so yeah, let's look at the packaging now. Let's look at the figures. Um, first guys, it's it's got the Lando Calrissian figure. Give you a little close look at him. Please just focus on him like that. So yeah, this is this is a five to eight figure. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, this is my first three and a quarter inch Lando figure from the solo line. So yeah, his accessory is it is his blaster. So yeah, it. I'm sorry, it's pretty it's it's pretty plain and simple. So yeah, but the thing, but the but the difference with this gun, this gun is only half because. If you can see the image from the picture, I, 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 and the gun goes up to there, but there's like, I like there's like a more, and it's bigger, and, and, and it's longer. Like, to the 6 Black Series one I reviewed, the gun was longer, so I don't know why is this one small for, but yeah. So, so looking at the figure, it's it's a pretty cool one, but it's a standard 5 PY, so yeah, it's, it's, so yeah, it's not really, really good, honestly. But yeah, it got some really nice molds on the, um, which be cool, really nice looking. So yeah, this um this um cape is removable and the scarf is 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 attached to it, on which on which is pretty cool and at, at the same time good because because if you're like a, a younger kid, you might lose this like separately. I saw it's pretty cool. Hasbro did that. Look at the cape, it's really nice. And we've got the yellow, really nice yellow. We've got the holster. A blaster that fits in there really well with the yellow. So yeah, so yeah. Now look at the articulation. Articulation wise, head can go side, true side, through sixty, and that far up, that far backwards, and, and that's all you get for articulation. So yeah, so guys, as you guys, I I I speed my I speed, I speed my review after the Lana figure now, and now I'll be right back for the um Castle Guard review and then that. Right back. Hey guys, I'm back, and now guys, we'll look at the castle guard. But but first, look at his accessory. He comes with his, see, he comes with his staff, which is pretty pretty plain and simple. We've got we've got a little detail on there at the top. That's just pretty plain and simple. But look at the accessory. Let's look at the figure. So yeah, this figure is a pretty cool figure. I say this this figure has to be this figure has to be the start of the pack. I really like this figure. I will probably be like one of my favorite um solo figures now. I don't know. I think so. Probably, probably my favorite. It's really nice with the head sculpt. It's a pretty good head sculpt. I really like his head. He's got armor on there. Really, really, really nice colors and the weathering on it. Really cool. And the fingers too. The weathering on there is really nice. And and his and his skirt here looks really nice. The, the weathering and stuff, which is really cool. I, I really like this outfit. It looks really nice. Back, it's a pretty cool figure. I highly recommend this guy. So yeah, articulation, head can go up and down. Like that, and side to side, and 360, and and the legs can, and the, and the legs can, and the legs can't go up because I'm because the skirts in the way, but it can go backwards. Far it goes backwards, so yeah, and, and at the bottom we've got the full link logo. So yeah, guys, that's that's been my relook at the um, I'm the castle guard now. I'm right back onto this gun. I am back, guys, and now guys, look look at this um, gun, a missile launcher thing. So yeah, 
This is, see, see, yeah, this is a pretty good thing, it's the saw app, because it's falling down. It's, oh, but yeah, this is, a, this is a pretty cool thing to have in the set, outside of that. I thought I did a great job on it, I really liked it. It's, it, it, it's way better than, it's way better than the builder weapon things that Hasbro has been making. I mean, it's true, practical, honest, really crappy. Yeah, but this, yeah, but, yeah, but this is really cool. Hey, hey, so yeah, how, yeah, so yeah, how you assemble it, you take these things off. So you take the tripod off and stuff. And that thing in there is one piece, and this thing too, you take it off too, which is pretty cool. But yes, yeah, so, so yeah, so yeah, it has articulation in there. That's really cool. Can swivel. Just look at the um, um, this. It's pretty plain and simple. Um, but yeah, better better look closer look at that. That's really nice. But I'll be right back to show you how it, um how it, it goes with, goes with the castle guard. Right back. I'll see you guys, it's the, this is what it looks like when the Kessel Guard is holding it, which is pretty cool, honestly, it's really cool, it's, it's like from the movie, but yeah, this is like, so yeah, but I'll be right back to end off this review. So guys, that's been my review of the Star Wars Fulton 2.0 Kessel Guard Low like current Tune the Quarren set, so guys, thank you for watching my video, make sure, I, I make sure, you, I, I make sure you comment down below any questions or anything, please like, comment, subscribe, follow me on Instagram, I'll leave a link to that in the description box below. Thank you guys for watching. I've watched this video. Rokon out. Bye.